Hey, this is David Kirshner from the Hempstead Town Courthouse, and uh, we just wrapped up the, uh, the hearing for the eminent domain regarding uh, the Capri Motel. A couple of quick things. Number one, uh, the decision um, on what to do to the, for the Capri is going to be done in stages. So the, um, the community has until March 1st to get all written notices into the government. And then uh, between March 1st, between March 1st and March 31st, uh, the judge will review the items and then he will render a decision by March 31st. Another date to note is May 28th, and at that point, the town needs to submit ideas on what to do with the property under eminent domain. Uh, so we heard from the town's lawyer. We also heard from people in the community, including Maureen Greenberg, who's on the West Hempstead Civic Association. Uh, we heard from citizens in the community. Uh, one message that was loud and clear was that there's a huge concern about illegal immigration uh, coming in place of the Capri, so that's something that people were very concerned about. There were suggestions of making it into a parking lot. Uh, there were suggestions of affordable housing, um, but basically almost everyone here outside of the lawyer who was um, Christopher Brown uh, defending the owner of the Capri, pretty much everyone here is saying shut it down, shut it down, but it doesn't sound like the town of Hempstead really has a full-blown plan, so this is going to be phased out. This is David Kirshner for West Hempstead Echo at Town of Hempstead. Town Hall. Thank you. Have a good night.